Hello YouTube, today I'm going to be showing you how to put Windows 7 on a USB flash drive to uh, install it on a laptop without a DVD drive per se or whatever you want to do with it. Uh, so what you're going to be needing is uh, a Windows 7 ISO or the copy on a DVD. Um, if you have the ISO you're going to probably want to mount that to as a virtual drive using something is something like Daymount Tools which is very easily obtained by just googling it and it's right there and going to download and downloading but I'm not going to do that for this video because we have the DVD and for the sake of time so first thing you need to do is you're put your CD in and a 4 gig or more flash drive you're going to uh, then load up the command prompt this will also work with uh, Windows Vista in case you want to do this for Windows Vista but I don't know why you would Alright, so um, I have this little instruction sheet here that I've written up, and uh, I'll put this on the sidebar for you guys, put it here for now. So what you're going to need to do first is basically just type in disk part. Alright, so now it'll start up. Now you're going to type in list disk to see which disk you're going to be needing. From right here, I know that disk one is my four gigabyte flash drive that I have plugged in. Some people might have a ton, but I only have two. So now I'm just gonna type in select disk one. Now I'm gonna type in clean. Now I'm gonna type in create partition primary. I'm going to type in select partition 1. I'm going to uh, set that as active. And then I'm going to format it to FAT32 by typing in this. I'll have all these commands in the sidebar, so uh, don't worry about that. In the more info tab, I mean. Alright. So now this will take a while. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and pause the... Uh, video and I'll come back to you when it's done. Okay, so now we're back um, into the thing and now we've got the disk completely formatted. So now we're going to type in assign. Alright. Close out of that. And now type in exit. So now we're done with the disk part portion. So now we're going to type in X copy space. Now you're going to put the drive letter of your DVD drive. If you need to check that, just go to my computer. And for the for the uh, DVD drive, it is D. So I'm going to put X copy D colon star dot star slash s slash e slash f space and the flash drive letter is f f colon then press enter so now this will just copy basically everything from the DVD drive to the flash drive I'm going to go ahead and pause the video as this might take a while and come back to you. So I'll be right back. Okay, now it's done. And uh, take your flash drive and put it in your computer. Set it to boot to flash drive, and that's it. All right. Uh, thanks for watching to, um, this video, and uh, please rate, comment, subscribe. See ya.